It's Brittany Levy here from Stay Current, and this is an APSA article of interest that you should know. This article about the use of antifibrinolytics in pediatric life-threatening hemorrhage was published in the Journal of Critical Care Medicine in 2022. So the real question here is, does the administration of tranexamic acid or aminocaproic acid improve outcomes in pediatric hemorrhage? So what exactly did they do? Well, they looked at 24 different children's hospitals across North America and Italy, where they found about 450 pediatric patients between the ages of zero and 17 who had received blood, either through a massive transfusion protocol or had received more than 40 milliliters per kilogram over about six hours. So what exactly did they find? Well, they found that in kids that had gotten that antifibrinolytic therapy, there was reduced mortality at both a 6 and 24 hour time point. Well, that's pretty impressive. So tell us what you think. Do you routinely administer these medications at your center? Leave it in the comments below and be sure to check back for more articles of interest and articles that you should know.